So it's that time of year. The sun's out, the weather's getting warm, and you're thinking about going swimming. Well, no, you're just thinking about going to the pool because I know half of y'all can't swim. But yeah, you're going to the pool. But there's just one problem. How do you avoid messing up your waves? Well, first you have to think of several things. Number one, what do I do when I'm at the pool? And number two, what do I do after I leave the pool? Okay, calm down. Because your boy Wave Man Mike, yep, that's me. I got you. I got you. I got you. Well, first off, before I help you with anything, I need you to help me with something. Go hit that like button and subscribe. See, that was super easy. It took you like two seconds to help me, opposed to the multiple minutes I'm about to spend helping you. Okay, your first question is, what do I do while I'm at the pool? Well, the only thing I can think of is protecting your hair. You know how you wear your do-rag in the shower to prevent your hair from frizzing up? Well, this is just like that. Throw your do-rag a wave cap on to keep your hair laid down. This is actually pretty obvious, but most wavers don't even think of. It. Just throw a swimming cap on top of your do-rag or wave cap. Since the swimming caps are waterproof, it should prevent the water to get into your hair. Now you might be asking, why don't I just use a swimming cap and leave my do-rag at home? Well, that's because the swimming cap will most likely mess your waves up. It's not like there's a silky swimming cap, unless there is and I just don't know about it. But anyway, throw your do-rag on and put your swimming cap on top of that. Don't worry about how it looks, trust me. If enough wavers see this video and start doing it, it'll just become a trend and everybody will be doing it anyway. Then it'll be seen as stylish. Just look at all the other stupid stuff people do just because other people do it. Okay, so now you're wondering, what do I do after I get out the pool? Well, if you're like me and you want to show your waves off for the rest of the day, your best bet is to have a brush with you. So have a do-rag with you. So have a backpack with you. Inside your backpack, you'll have many things. But of those things, these are the most important. Number one, a medium brush. Number two, a plastic bag. And number three, some lotion, because your knees are probably ashy. <laughs> <laughs> wow, seriously though, have a medium brush, because you need to fix anything that got messed up. And you already know, the hard brush is just gonna pick up your hair too much, and the soft brush isn't gonna fix anything. So bring that medium brush. And the plastic bag is just to lay your hair back down. Listen, I can go on and on forever with a bunch of tips, but I'm gonna stop here. All you need is those most important tips, and you'll be good. Hey, I heard that like button was talking trash. Make sure to hit it to teach it a lesson. Comment, comment on this video or your poopiest. Comment on this, comment on this. Bruh, comment on this video or you're gonna poop yourself in your sleep. And subscribe or you or a loved one will. You know what? <laughs> Just subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'm Wave Man Mike. Enjoy your day.